as we know from other projects in other parts of India, that everywhere NHPC and similar agency, wherever there are built dams or such big constructions have been have taken place, everywhere they have promised that local people or local communities are going to benefit substantially from such projects. But nowhere, unfortunately, it happened in that manner. So when the hills really started to come down, when the stones started to roll down from the hilltop, where that road, the NH31A, on which all these people's livelihood depended so heavily, it started to be started to become impossible. Everywhere people have started asking questions. Now they can see what the dam means. Now they can see what construction is. And now can they, they can see for themselves that what sort of good it's going to bring for them. We need to challenge this whole paradigm of development, whole discourse of development, which keeps local people in the dark, which destroys the environment, which generates some employment and some capital for some privileged, for some elite construction companies, some contractors, some corrupt politicians, but which creates no permanent assets. It creates permanent problems. And these problems are not only for the, these are dams. They're, they're damming the river. They're damming the river and they're sending it to its death, to its doom. 